Hi, this is Nathan, your neighborhood arcade and pinball talk guy. We're going to be reviewing Gottlieb's Canada Dry today. Uh, please look for a review underneath the description of our YouTube video, as well as like, follow us on Arcade and Pinball Talk and our groups on Facebook, Instagram. We also just joined Twitter. Find us on there. And uh, go ahead and click that red subscribe button down below this video. Uh, be a bull. It's red for a reason. Hit that thing. Let's go ahead and get this review underway, shall we? Very interesting table setup, first impressions. And again, this is a wood rail fixed state game. Uh, Playfield is actually set up pretty cool. I'm kind of liking it for a wood rail. I mean, you've got uh, obviously the columns to the right are a little bit of a special one lit trick shot. You have your drop targets to the top that spell out Canada Dry, so you can bonus out up there. You have a flipper to the top left, middle right. You also have some drop targets to the middle, pop bumper to the left behind the target there, and uh, two in lanes, two out lanes, and uh, a little area that's a special uh, with two columns to the middle right of the table. So all in all, pretty pretty decent table, and you also got a wide open middle to hit those uh, to hit those uh, drop targets to the very back of the table. Uh, now again, this is a little bit of a slower playing table just because of the age of it. And, uh, you know, even from the virtual format, you could hear it buzzing. It buzzes because of the electrical charge going through the flippers. Uh, that's what activates them. But, you know, a lot of these older fixed state tables, even in recreations like in virtual pinball, uh, they're going to be played a little slower just because that's how they normally play. Um, so table mechanics on this I actually like a lot. The layout I think is awesome. Uh, I also think that, uh, you know, although it doesn't have a soundtrack, uh, you know, it the binging and clanging is perfectly fine for an old state like this one. Uh, replayability is going to be there too, just because of the setup. I mean, look at this thing. Although it's a themed Canada Dry uh, uh, playfield and, and table, uh, it, it, it is actually laid out very good. So the replayability, I think, on this one is going to be up there, as well as the fun factor. But all in all, check this one out. Decent game. Uh, other than that, please look for a review under the description of our YouTube video, and please uh, stay tuned for our next video. Thank you again for watching today.